Tagging doors and windows in Revit is one of the fastest things that you can do in the program. I will point out that when you're first dropping the doors and windows in, if when you execute that command, and in this case I picked on the architecture command, I'm going to pick on door, that if tag on placement had been highlighted, it would have automatically placed the tags in at each door location as I was dropping them in. But perhaps we didn't want to have that, or maybe we made a copy of the view, the tags just didn't carry over into the copy of the view. If we want to be able to place tags after the fact, we can do that. Underneath the Annotate tab, there's going to be an option called Tag All. Technically, it's Tag All, not Tagged. Highlight Door Tags, come down on the list, hold down the Control key, and select on Window Tags. Now that Door Tags and Window Tags are both highlighted, if you select on OK, it will automatically tag every door and window in the project. Now certain types of doors, such as the regular doors that we placed in, will have a number already associated with it. And the reason is, is that doors and windows, when they're first inserted in, will automatically have a number usually associated with them. But certain kinds of doors, such as the ones you'll find in your curtain walls, by default usually don't have a door number associated with them. So to give them a door number, you can just click on the door tag, click on the little question mark that shows up down there, and then you can fill in that information. For instance, if this needs to be number 6 or 106, you can type that information in. I can come up here, select on this, click the question mark, type the appropriate information. Another thing that I could do is go into the schedule and change it on the door schedule. It would automatically update here in the bubbles. Also, if I select on the door itself, look over for its mark number over here, and type in whatever number I want it to be. In this case, I'll type in a longer number, such as 109. We can now see that this is door number 109. So as a result of this, if you want to tag your doors and windows, and actually a variety of other objects, quickly on the fly, it's a simple matter of coming up here to the Annotate tab, selecting on Tag All, telling it which objects you want to give a tag to, and then clicking OK, and it'll automatically tag each and every one of them. Then to change the information in the tag, either go into the door schedule and change it there. In this case, this project currently doesn't have a door schedule set up. You can change it by selecting on the door itself and then changing the properties of it over here. Or finally, you can select on the tag, click in the tag, and then manually change it to be the number you want it to be.